हेलो या नितिन गुड आफ्टरनून डॉक्टर विजेंद्र को मेयर पीडिया गुड आफ्टरनून सर How are you, uh, Nitam? Are you ready for yes. uh, mock interview of Niti? Yes, sir. Okay. So, uh, Nitam, uh, you uh, want to join Niti Bombay? When did you graduate? Uh, in the year 2016, sir. 16. So, can you tell me briefly what were you doing after 16? Uh, sir, after graduation, I joined service industry as an industrial engineer, uh, where I, where I worked for 26 months. Okay. Uh, let, uh, during my work experience. Work, ex- work tenure, most of the, my senior managers suggested me that sh- I should go for higher, higher education. Okay. Mostly in management sector. So I decided to quit my job and prepare, prepare for GATE. Okay. So uh, uh, how many years did you do job? Uh, 26 months, sir. 26. Two years, two months. So your maximum job is in uh, uh, Caresoft Global Private Limited, right? Yes, sir. You were as industrial engineer and graduate engineer trainee. Yes, sir. Same industry? Same industry, sir. Yes. I, first of all, I joined as a GET graduate engineer trainee. Mm-hmm. After one year, I promoted as an industrial engineer. So, you have worked as industrial engineer as well as operation manager, right? Yes. Can you tell Currently, me? Currently, I am working as an operation manager. Presently, you are operation manager, huh? Yes, yes, in different industry. Okay. Uh, Nitim, I would like to uh, ans- uh, ask a question from you. What is the difference between operation manager and project manager? Sir, product manager is basically related to some, some specific kind of field. I'm asking, project take... man- I'm asking project manager. Okay, project manager, okay. And you are also to tell me the difference between project and operation. Okay. Sir, I believe both are the same thing only because project manager should have knowledge about all the projects happening under him. And operation manager is same as who is handling the project, who is taking, taking care of all the process, how... It, it is getting executed. So, operation manager is also into different phases of the project. You know, project has different phases. Sorry, sir, your voice is not clear. Uh, can you tell me the different phases of the project? Project has different phases, no? Yes, sir. So, what are the different phases of the project? Uh, sir, any project is divided into small, small activi- activities. Okay. Uh, we, small activities can. Combining together makes one task or job. Okay. And many jobs combined together make one project. Okay. No, uh, different phases of the project like planning, execution and all these things? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay. First, first of all, it's coming and planning. Okay. Uh, later on, sorry sir, I'm not sure about it. So, you do not know about that, huh? No, 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 sir. Okay, uh, so as an operation manager, you worked an industrial engineer also you worked. So can you tell me the yes. difference between engineer and the manager? Sir, engineer is basically related to some specific kind of task, whereas manager handle at a one time different, different projects. Okay. In, engineer basically having a, of knowledge of one particular domain, but manager may have knowledge of different, different do- domain. As it is a higher level of engineer, so he must be ha- having a broader knowledge compared to one engineer. Okay, so uh, manager has broader knowledge than engineer, huh? Yes, sir. So is, it important, work experience. so, is it important for you to be engineer to become a manager in industry? Sorry, sir. Could you please come is again? It, is it important for you to be engineer before becoming manager in the industry? Uh, uh, no, sir. If I, if I am talking about technical kind of industry like manufacturing, then... Then... To become a good manager, we should have we should know about technical thing. Like if you take a if you take an example of any uh, manufacturing industry, okay. Let let's say particular kind of job shop industry where some lathe machine, milling machine, milling machines are there. So to be a good manager, to be a good manager of that industry, we should ha- know how the lathe machine is working, how the milling machine is working, so that operator, small small operators cannot uh, take the advantage of our knowledge. Okay. They should not, they cannot fool us. Okay. Any idea about uh, industrial fatigue? What is industrial fatigue? Uh, yes, sir. It, it's kind of allowance which we provide to to give some some kind of relaxation to the operator uh, okay. during their d- 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 during their work tenure. Okay. Hmm. So that is the industrial fatigue. Huh? How to overcome industrial fatigue, sir? Whenever we decided task time. For completion of one job, 
we provide some allowance like relaxation allowance contingency okay. allowance policy allowance okay by providing allowance we can give them freedom to get overcome whatever whatever they have feel exertion during their work okay to overcome that fatigue okay you know you have conducted line balancing training in uh, uh, some uh, uh, project so can you tell me yes, what is the meaning yes. of line balancing sir line balancing simply means in in any plant every work session should have same amount of work content why that is so if, sir if the work content will be same throughout the throughout the work session of the plant then it will help to run the production line smoothly okay and we can decide we can decide our cycle time and based on the cycle time we can quote to our customer then in this days we are going to complete your task what is the relation between balance delay and line efficiency balance delay and line efficiency sir line efficiency means what we can able to produce out of 100% for example if our efficiency is 77 77% this is our line efficiency and balance delay means out of 100 by by subtracting 77% whatever we will get that is 23% that is balance delay that is a balance delay right yes yes okay listen tell me amount by which so we are making delay 100 minus efficiency is balance delay yeah yes sir so if line is not uh, balanced properly what the trouble will come uh if line is not properly balanced then it it um, an extra unwanted material handling will be there we are not able to complete our task on on the time and and in future it may cause unnecessary material handling which may increase our cost so unnecessary material handling what is the technical name for that uh i was knowing knowing that term, sir but as of now it's not coming can we call it in process inventory yes 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 sir so what is uh, i mean uh, inventory that is a good thing or bad thing no sir we should not have inventory it's bad thing because it's block it's block our money but don't you think like uh, nowadays entire india is blocked out and uh, closed shut down if inventory yes. is not there is not there how the production will be uh, we can do the production like uh, uh, no no we cannot do anything if inventory is not there i mean if uh, inventory is not there with kriana shop he cannot see sell the products uh true sir but inventory should not be more than the demand actual demand means if our line is, line is balanced by using some kind of technique like just in time we can we can able to satisfy the customer need if we putting extra inventory more than the requirement means that we, that means we are blocking our money so do you think just in time is a successful uh, uh, thing for india in indian no, context sir. uh totally speaking in indian in in constant this is not this is not suggestible because uh, in india many small scale industries need to depend most mostly just for the just in time vendor play a big role sir if we have good relationship with our vendor then we are able to implement just in time successfully but if our vendor is not able to deliver of our product on time then in that case just in time will fail and as we current as we very well aware of the in indian scenario so vendor relationship or vendor policy in most of the cases get lag so we ne- in that case we need to we, we should have ex- excess of inventory so that is what i'm telling you that uh, you should have inventory to run the show right or not yes sir okay uh, now can you tell me why you want to join uh, niti bombay uh, satyam uh actually sir uh during my gra- during my work experience many of the manager told me you should go for mba and for mba as you are currently working as an industrial engineer so to gain more knowledge about engineering and management both combined technical plus management skill niti is the only best place which can guide you which can lead you lead you toward your achieving dream goal so what is your dream goal can i ask you that uh, sir my dream goal is to manage a small number of group 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 of people under me you want to be entrepreneur right yes sir okay and uh, you know uh, right now suppose uh, somebody is uh, uh, managing a group of people under him and running the show and it is totally locked down how you shall pay the salary to all of them they are sitting at home what you will do that is real correctly, correctly sir i correctly sir i do agree but this 
this this this kind of problem will will not occur randomly is if we check the frequency of occurrence of this kind of activity will be very very small hardly it happens after 5 to 6 years one once once in a while once in a while so, so this is not a trouble huh? yes sir this not this kind of thing is not a big trouble okay in that case okay nikum so uh, let me give you your feedback now i think uh, nitin kya hai ki jo bhi aap likh rahe ho na whatever you have written in your form like line balancing and everything whatever technical yes, term you are writing that you are operation manager you are industrial engineer so he is going to ask you question from that particular word correct so you need to be very very meticulous in those words you need to be very clear yes. in that yes, and uh, like uh, uh, you started with a quality word if you write then he will enter into quality and then similarly like one uh, link to another it will go quality control quality assurance zero defect in process inventory because line is needs to be balanced because then you should not waste uh, uh effort or time in uh, in process inventory and then the concept of just in time comes and he is going to ask you those questions so whatever you have written uh, intro question normally will be asked from the industrial engineering aspect of uh, what you have written so in your yes, entire sir. form wherever you have written industrial or management engineering related uh, 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 domains just prepare it very well and before going to the interview and you know we are having many mock interviews where we are discussing these things every day and i am explaining also answer so keep listening to the videos of others also that is the purpose sure sir so whatever questions we are discussing just listen to others also i have already discussed these things somewhere else and revise these topics like inventory quality project management product manager uh, what is portfolio manager what is operation and what is the project operation versus project so uh, what is the operation management what is the operation research these things should be very very clear to us fine sure sir just uh, your uh, this um, interview is good i mean you have done good but uh, enhance some clarity and uh, uh, keep uh, going for more uh, frequent mocks that will increase your okay, confidence sir. fine okay sir okay nitin thank you sir sir one question sir, sir. Yes, yeah uh, i told operation manager and project manager both are both are same sir is actually, it not actually yeah, i wanted to uh, yes i wanted to give answer to this question to you because uh you see project is a more holistic domain operation is execution part of that okay, i was okay, asking okay. you what are the various phases of project if you go to uh, your pd education no there are project management ke videos pade hue hain just go yes, through sir. the videos of project management and if you go through those videos you will find that project had different phases so there is a planning okay. phase execution phase then uh, those kind of phases are there follow up phase so uh, you need to execution more or less operation means execution part of that so you will say sir project is a holistic domain many resources are involved many people are involved in that operation is a uh, phase of that that is what you can think of okay means can we say operation manager comes under project manager no you cannot say that because operation manager is also project manager only but with a specific okay. domain yes but if some project is very big project then project senior project manager will be project manager and um, junior manager can be uh, operation manager but sometime for particular operation you take uh, equal hierarchy managers also so strictly speaking okay. you may not say that okay sir yeah right okay, so Thank operation you. manager yes. may be specific or expert in particular operation he is more uh, i'll say specialist than project manager who is more generic who's more okay. generalist he is a general domain manager okay sir right uh, sir for technical part point of view apart from operation research which subject should i prepare that's what no industrial engineering entire part you have to do quality control project management break even analysis entire industrial engineering i can say you okay 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 so entire industrial engineering you revise well and keep listening okay. to the other interviews also and i'm explaining these things every day to all the students so you just revise that okay sir by the time we go for intro no i will be uploading some 20 30 40 videos audios interactions so just okay, listen to all okay and be calm in the interview and uh, just answer whatever you know whatever you don't know don't answer that's it that is the okay, sir. that is the okay thank okay. you thank you sir okay.